Hey YouTube, have a quick video of how to change the upper pressure power steering hose on a 2004 Honda Accord inline 4. Uh, I already jumped the gun. I already took it off. But the reason I'm starting this video is a little bit late is because I haven't mentioned before I like to make sure that I do the work properly before I do it and then show you guys how to get it done. I'm a little bit short on time uh, we're getting ready to go to a party don't have my watch but time is close and uh, I really want to took this one off um, all it is is just taking off the two bolts up here one here removing the plug pigtail connection right here and then it has ah uh, geez that's two more, two more screws. One down here and another one down here somewhere. Uh, so what you wanna do is remove those and then get a 19 millimeter wrench and take it off from there. What I did is remove this line from here to give me a little bit of support. Remove this bracket from down here to give me a little bit more of a support angle. Support to give me more room. So I could reach in there and do what I got to do. So, anyways, fast forward. I already took off the sensor from there. We're going to plug in the sensor right in here. Tie it down. This one is also, also 19 millimeter. Also. <laughs> okay. Now we're going to set this sucker back down in here slip it in through here all right so when you slip it down there what you want to do is come over here and give it a nice little tug and try to fit it in place first things first you want to try to screw this in here first and see if they'll let me all right get the 19 millimeter and finish bolting down that line right there all right so what you want to do is just go ahead and wrench it down so just tie that down and then we're gonna move on to the next step all right so the next thing you want to do is after you have that bolted down you just want to sit everything in place that way you know what the distance of everything is gonna take. So, there, everything's sitting down just like it's going to be run. So now we just put all these little brackets back in place. All right, so first we're gonna start off by, by bolting down our bracket line. Uh, you wanna make sure that it does have an O-ring this one does fantastic sometimes uh, they don't come with o-rings you might have to take it off the original one uh, which is a bad idea because they should come with brand new o-rings um, so there it's snapped in place put this in there like so all right and then just drag them down All right, after that is snug and tight, what you want to do is plug in your sensor. The sensor is way down here. I want to plug it right in there. The sensor we just put in. There it is. All right, now we're going to put the rest of our brackets on. All right, the first one goes right here. And let me see, it goes like like this it goes like this so let's go ahead and open it up and put it in here close it in and we're gonna bolt it down just like so all right and once you have that in place you're just gonna go ahead and 
drive it in. It is aluminum, so you don't want to over tighten it. There it is, nice and snug. Well, it's not that snug, but it's all right. What we're gonna do now is make sure we tighten down this last one and we should be ready to go. All right, so I went ahead and put our little rubber mount right here. Now we're gonna put our little plate to lock it in place. All right, so there, we got it down there. Now we're gonna get the last bolt and bolt it down. All right, so now we're gonna just bolt it down. All right, there it is. I have this angle on here with the 10. Whoa. It disappeared. Here it is. Freaking flew in the hell out of here. <laughs> wow. And there it is. It's bolted down, ready to go. Ready to start it up. Sweet. And that's how you change the upper pressure hose for the power steering on a 2004 Honda Accord inline four. Thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe. Don't forget to hit that bell. All right, let's get out of here before we get kicked out.